My question for you is, what could I use this for? Could I use this for anything? Can you think of what I could use this for? Or should I just gift it or sell it on Marketplace? Hey Zesties, I'm Michelle Boyle and welcome or welcome back to my channel Zesty Girl. I'm just heading out to Big W to check out their makeup sale because I need foundation, I need lipstick, I need mascara. Like I've got none of those things. So I saw that they were on sale today and I thought yes. Okay, so if you want to come to Big W with me and check it out then, oh we also need some tomatoes and some bread from Aldi. So if you want to come with me then let's do it. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, it's apparent that everything in the makeup section, not everything, but pretty much most things are on sale. Let's head over here because this is where we want to go. So this is the L'Oreal True Match Foundation, which I love as well, but not quite as much as my Rimmel. Look at the amazing amount of different colours. Look at the amazing range of colours. So amazing. I'm sort of normally up in the beiges up here. And then we have this. Moving along. Actually, I do need some of this powder, actually. Oh, look how pretty those colours are. Okay, I am after these two. And I'm after this. Wow, what a great price. Well, this is such a quick shop. Okay, and finally I'm after this. Oh, I love it. They have my color. Well, that was the quickest shopping haul ever. Everything I needed and all half price. Wow. It's in clearance today. $3 for these jeans. I'm not sure this is in clearance though. Even got a tag on it. If it was, I'd probably grab it. Not that I need a denim mini skirt. Well, these shorts are nice. Seven dollars too expensive. Denim mini skirts are three dollars each. Are you serious? Wow. At size 18. It says 18, size 16, size 14. There's a size 8. There's no tens by the look of it. They're black as well. I'm leaving the three dollar denim mini skirts for you guys because I have plenty of them. I have them in trying to get rid of some down in the garage. So yeah. Going to be a, so this was going to be a big W shop with me, the makeup section of Big W because it's half price. All the makeup's half price. So I raced down to get these half price sales, these half price specials, and then I just thought I was going to do like a shop with me at Big W, but I just. I didn't feel like it. I've done Target, I've done Kmart recently. I just, I just didn't feel like doing that. So I came home, it was only a three minute video. So what I thought I would do is I'll show you what I got, I'll show you what I'm loving in my makeup, and then we'll go and declutter, because you know I'm simplifying my life. So I thought today, why not do makeup? I'm really not pushing myself, well I am pushing myself with simplifying my life and decluttering and yeah, really making my life simple. But I'm not pushing myself as far as doing too much so that I end up in a big mess, because it's easy for me to do as you can see by my meal prepping. And if you haven't seen my meal prep video, I'll link it up, I'll link it up here. So that should be really fast because I don't really use that much makeup, don't really use that much skincare. I'm not really being very good again with my skincare to be honest. So maybe if I change things around, it might it might help. It might really help. The other thing is I have a three-tier basket that I've loved so much in my bath bathroom, in my bathroom, that holds all my things in it. It, it's just not working for me anymore. It's just it's just not working. I don't want it anymore. I want something much more simple. So I don't know if you remember the Kmart haul where I bought the Lazy Susan that I would, had no purpose for. I'm going to try that in its place. And then I'll get rid of the basket on Marketplace or give it away or something like that. Okay, so that's what we're doing. So let's get straight into and let me show you what makeup I love at the moment plus my new makeup. Okay, so in the old days, back in the executive days, I used to buy really sexy stuff like Estee Lauder and everything, but since I've been a mum, I just go for whatever works, and whatever's sort of cheap and works. So this is my absolute favourite foundation, which I got yesterday. It is, I think it's number, see I haven't got my glasses on now, it doesn't really matter, it's something like a classic beige, I think it is. So that's that. 
this I love this I love it love it love it love it love it it is the best mascara in the world and I don't like it at its price that it is now but at $10.50 which I got it yesterday I love that price so here are two that I can throw out now because they're no good and I can throw this one out because I've used that up but it was terrible and this is the one that I got from Kmart which I was trying out but it's terrible but I'm still using it because it's still black enough so I can put the black stuff on and then use this one to like spread it out nicely so that's okay what else did I buy at Kmart? Oh, so this, I've just been through another one of these. I love this so much from Kmart, that OX, what brand, what's the brand called? Ox, or whatever it is there. What is it? There it is. Um, I love this so much, this concealer. So that's like $4 or something, so that's another favourite. Um, what else have I got? So I, I should have got another one of these yesterday, my favourite blue eyeliner. My groovy favourite blue eyeliner. And these are just... Don't worry about all that stuff. Okay, this was the palette I bought the other day at Target. I am so in love with this palette. I just, I love it so much. I cannot believe how much I love it. So I've been wearing it every day and I'm so happy with it. I just, I adore it. So that's that. Um, I've been back using this one recently. There's only a couple of colors that I love. So I love these three here and this one, obviously, and this one. So I can put that, give that one a rest again. What else? I did need this, but I didn't get it because I'm going to use something else that I've got to use up. So that, I did actually need that. That's another favorite. And then my favorite lipsticks, matte lipsticks, are these ones. So these are the two. And one's Embrace and one's Seduce. And these are so old. And then I've just replaced them with these two new ones in exactly the same color. Okay, let me just quickly show you the empties. Okay, so a couple of things. This palette here... The Elf. I have loved and adored this so much as you can see. I'm not sure if I'll replace it now that I've got my new ones but that was what I was looking to replace with this one from Kmart and thinking that the this color up here would be similar to this or similar to this one but it's so dark it's not similar at all so that was a bit of a waste of money but it was only four dollars. Okay so here's my bathroom here's the ensuite and this is my basket that's a bit messy at the moment. So I need to go through this and see what I'm going to keep. You see what I mean? It's not that practical with grabbing things out of. That's the basket. And then I have my top drawer here with this that I got from Costco. So we'll go through everything in here. This was my number one favorite palette. It's the only one that I've actually ever spent any money on. This is another makeup drawer. So I'm not sure how much of this I'll keep. Next one down has got some bits and pieces in it. These are foundations that I bought that are just the wrong color. So why I keep them, I don't know. And this bottom drawer is just some random sort of things. And then under here, there's not really a lot going on because I don't really keep a lot of things. So this is um, some skincare, extra sit skincare, hair dye. There was a system going on down here. So this is sun, sun tanning creams. And this was body creams and oils, and this was hair stuff. And then that's just a bit of extra stuff. And yeah, so just could tie this up really quickly. One basket's missing actually. It's my, my face mask basket. Hang on. And here that is. So I have been using these once a week. So to start out, I don't think I'm going to get rid of any of these because they're all fairly new. They're not, some of them are samples from things I've got. And I've got one on top, so I want to use that one. Um, yeah, but I can't see anything here that's that's not going to be used. Move on to hair care. <laughs> the extent of my hair care, it's been embarrassing. Okay, so I need to do my roots at the moment, and I am I have been using the root cover because I need to actually do hair, dye them. So this has got such a little squirt in it, so I'll put that up the top to use. And then what is this? So this is dry shampoo, so I use it occasionally. This is, and this is hair mousse. I don't really, oh, oh yeah, I could use hair mousse. And I don't know, that's a top, so I'll put it there. And this is like a dry shampoo powder that I got for free in one of the black boxes, I'm pretty sure. So that's all right, and I've got some hairspray up top, so I'll put that down with this lot. So we'll keep that as that. I like to have that here. Okay, next. Now, what is this? This is white glow toothpaste. So I'm going to put that up the top to so just use that up. It's terrible, but I mean, it's not going to do any harm, but it doesn't actually do the job. Okay, what's this lotion? Hand and body lotion. I might put this down in the guest bathroom. 
Okay, now this here, Tondra Poison, is was my favorite perfume for so many years, and this will be off now because they haven't sold it for they haven't sold it for so long. And it was the saddest thing when they stopped selling it. So, so oh, it still smells good. It still, sm I'm going to keep it because I have so many memories of this perfume. I've only ever loved two perfumes. The one's beautiful by Estee Lauder, and this one. But they don't sell this one anymore. Actually, I wonder if I could research and find out if there was anything actually like it. See, the lid's busted. Anyway, I'm going to keep it just so I can remember what it smelled like. This is Elizabeth Arden Green Tea. And I've just run out of the perfume. Actually, this is what I was going to do. I was going to go through the empties. Um, I've just run out of the perfume, so I'm happy to have the body lotion. And I need to get the perfume. Because I used to just wear the perfume for every day because it's so fresh and smells lovely. Coconut oil. I don't think I'm covering my body with coconut oil. No. So that can go out. Oh, this is a hair product, smooth, smooth hair product, which I do use because I get the frizzies quite a lot. That's a toothbrush head, so that doesn't belong there. Beautiful body cream, so we'll keep that. And another one. So I just have to remember that they're here, so I might actually put that up the top, so I'll use it. So that's that. What an extensive range of creams I have. Okay, so we haven't got rid of much, but there wasn't that much to get rid of. Okay, next is, I don't know, it's rubbish bags, we they don't need to go there. So this is exfoliating, this is all the sun creams, this is, um, this is great, this is just if you want to do a quick tan and you haven't got time. And I love all of these, I got rid of the ones I don't love last year, so they are all current, my favourite one is this. I love it so much. I don't think we even need this. I'm just going to put it out. Need to clean the cupboard a little bit. Right. So that's done. That was easy. Now, oh, moving along. Now, so hair dyes are back here. Oh, this is, oh, I can't even lift up my tennis elbow. Here's my hair dyes. So to be honest, I'm never, I don't think I'm ever going to use this because I'm too scared to. So I've got two sort of blonde ones back there that I'm probably not going to use. This just men, no, my husband's never going to use this. So we'll just put that there. Get rid of that. Face mask can go with, okay, let me have a look through here and I'll get back to you and tell you what I decide. Okay, so I've sorted out some skincare here that I'm still keen to keep using. And I've got rid of a whole bunch here that's just either mostly used up, just like a little bit left, or um, that is expired or anything like that. So that's a whole container there full of that. It's not actually that much there because most of these are used up. So it just haven't been thrown away. And I've just kept some samples in here. And I'm going to put them up the top so that I can just remember I've got them. Because they look quite interesting. So I'm going to keep those. That's sort of it. That's some cotton buds and that's some coconut oil that I use quite a lot. And in the back there's some candles to replace the candles around the bath. And I think that's everything. It's really very simple. Very, very simple. I'm just getting rid of some things I can now go through here and see what I can add down below. So this here is another version of the root touch-up I use and this has got like one squirt left I imagine. Things don't really, even though this is pretty and I've really loved it, things really don't stand up that well in this. So I just like the fact that it was three tiers. I think I'll just go through and sort it out and then show you afterwards. Okay, so I've removed the three tier basket and it's empty. I'm just looking at the things I've got here and I'm just going to keep a very small amount of product out and use them up and see what I think. And if, I'd not, if I'm not enjoying using them, then I'll get rid of them. Now, I don't use this very often, so but it's almost actually gone. So I'll put this down with the other cream. So I'll bring up the basket with the creams in it so we can put those that we want to keep in there. Okay, so I enjoy using the ordinary products, so I'll put those there. So those three. In fact, these are all almost gone, so I could do with a new set of these. This cold pressed oil, I'm just going to check it. It might have gone off, so I'll just check it. Yes, that was gone. Uh, so, right, so there's my four products there. That thing's a bit dusty, actually. Uh, I love this hydrating toner by Sukin. 
So it's just a spray, so that's almost gone, so I'm going to keep using that. And then I'll decide whether I'm going to replace it. Just back with these. This one here, when I when I feel really dry, this works really well. The Sukin, this hydrating cream, hy hydrating gel cream. So I'll leave that out as well. And this hydration serum, not such a big fan of it, but I do use it sometimes. Then this is my favorite, favorite all-time product. This is. So I'll leave that there. And firming serum. Doesn't look like there's much left of that, so I'll leave that there. So these are all products that I use all the time. Okay, so the Olay retin Retinol I'll leave out as well. I haven't been using it, mostly because I forget that I even have it. Uh, this, I didn't even know I had this, and I love the Regenerous products by Olay, so I'm going to use that. I don't want to get too full so that I get overwhelmed. This is the night. This is the Olay night cream that I really love as well. So I'll put that there. And I'm going to put this Aldi day cream down here because I use Nivea. I've probably told you guys I'm in love, obsessed with Nivea. And so I might just leave that there. I've got another Sukin night cream that's brand new. So I'll leave that in the basket. And that's it. I think that's it. Let's look what's going on over here. So I've got a Nivea cream. This was a very old-fashioned one, and I bought it just for just just for, just for nostalgia, I think. And I tried it, and I just it was so thick and glucky. And then my other cream's been downstairs, so I've used it the last two days. And even though it's thick and glucky, once you actually get it rubbed into your skin, it actually works as a really good base for your foundation. But so anyway, I'll put that in back in here. Okay, now these are my hair things that I actually really do use quite a lot, so I'll pop these away. So it's this one, this one I use when I'm straightening, this one is a leave-in conditioner which has like got about two squirts left. Some more dry shampoo and some hairspray, so these all need to go away, so I'll just pop those away now. Okay, so that's where that stands at the moment, this is going back down under. Tidied this up a little bit more, so that's the same. And then over in this cupboard, I've just tidied up a bit more as well. So that's just, that's for like photo to stuff, but we don't carry a lot of sort of products like that. And then we've got the makeup bags there. We've got this for cleaning my husband's mouth guard. So I'll just put that in there. And then, oh, I don't think this works, so I have to check with him. I don't think it works. And... Then the hair products, so all the hair products that are in the front of this now are, were up the top, so I use them all. I put these two down uh, just to clear the top, but these are easy bins to get into. This is the cream I use all the time for my body, and then they're just the other options. I put hand creams in here as well, so there's not too many there, and then that. So now it's looking very, very amazing. Very, very amazing. Okay, I pulled these out of the cupboard as well. These, because my husband doesn't use aftershave balm. But there's three young guys just down the hall, their bathroom, they would love to use it. So I'll drop those up there. Found this in the back of the cupboard. I think it's a silk, I got it as a gift. Yeah, it's a silk eye mask. Yeah, it's like that, it's silk, but it's got, so your eyeballs are in there and they're not like right up against the fabric. So that's a very sexy eye mask that I got given as a gift. So I'm going to get rid of this. I have to say I'm getting really excited. I'm getting so good at this decluttering, so good. Okay, so there's some jewelry. Right, so here's this basket that I keep on hand over here, which I put my makeup in that's not coming with me, but at the moment it's on the floor in my bedroom because I was playing around with it today. So, but normally it sits in here. Um, toothpaste, right. This is toothpaste that goes in this mouth thing. It's meant to whiten your teeth. It doesn't, so I'm just going to put it in the rubbish, but it's almost gone, so it's only like two squirts left, but I can't be bothered doing it anymore because it doesn't work. These are the things that you use to shave your face. <laughs> yes, we need those. Uh, a comb, so I don't really need that out. This is a highlighter that can go away, the brush can go away. These are my husband's eye drops. This is my beautiful perfume that's empty, so I'll put that in the empties. This is a crystal that broke, so I'm going to throw that away. 
This is my other powder that I just adore. So I've still got a bit of this one left, which is great. And this I was trying out from Kmart as a highlighter. It was okay. Quite rave about it, but it was okay. And oh, I love my eye drops. So I'm just gonna empty that up, it's a bit dirty. Speaking of empties, I keep my empties down here to show you guys, and it's not very exciting. So we can go through these in like two seconds because you've seen it all before. So I'll just put that in there and we'll go in the other room and just have a quick look through. Okay, so this is my hair dye. I just did the roots and that was a few weeks ago. I need to do it, I need to do it again. So I've got another box of this, love it. Uh, these were the Aldi wipes, not bad, like they're not super good, but they, they do the job. So I'm happy with those. I love this from Aldi so much. I keep it in the shower. I replace it every time I run out. I go through it fast. So I really use it to get my makeup off at night. It's really great. Foaming cleanser. This was my green tea perfume that I just love that I've run out of. This is one of those uh, concealers from the OXX range it came out that I adore that I've used up. This is, I've used up this. I used an Olay face mask recently. This is, looks a bit dirty, but I'm not sure why it's so dirty. Oh, I know why, because this is so dusty being on the floor. Uh, this is my favorite, <laughs> favorite moisturizer. Here's another one. It's exactly the same, but it's in a tube. And the funny thing about it is I do use every bit. I cut it in half so I can get every little bit out. There's my, finish one of those. My beautiful perfume that's finished. Two mascaras, which I will be adding uh, two of these two, which I'm going to work out which ones are which. And then I've got another one here, and I've got another new one here. And finally, this Nivea, oops. Finally, this Nivea cream that I didn't really like. It wasn't very good. Hydrating day cream. I'm going to leave this out here because it's so dusty from being on the floor. I'm going to vacuum it. But that can all go in the rubbish. I'm not sure I want to do this today because it's organized. I'm just not sure I've got the energy to do this today as well. And But I can put these things away. So palettes go here. Like I can tell you straight away that I will be getting rid of this palette. I might as well just do it now because I'm not going to wear any of those colors and I don't know why I thought it was a good idea to buy that so that will be someone will love that I will be giving that away never used so these are the things that I'm giving away things this spontaneous buy at, at um, Aldi and it was cheap enough but it's disgusting it's so bad oh, I can't even show you it's some sort of oh, don't, don't worry it's some sponge and some sort of Foundation stuff is terrible. But anyway, we can do this, we can do this next time when we do something in the other in the bedroom, like I don't know what. That was some of the brushes. So I'm just gonna put the palettes here. This is my other e.l.f. palette that I really like, but I don't use it as much because I don't use those colours as much. A few, few things under here. But anyway, I'm going to do I'm going to do this another day. It's not that much. I can't be bothered doing it today. So I'm glad I didn't buy a new one. I'll use that up. And look, this is the loose powder I want to use up as well. Oh look, see, there's more mascaras in here, and I bet they're all they're all done. I bet you. So, but I just I can't do any more today. Most of these will be off. Most of these oils, and that is the worst cream in the world. That seven seven Olay. It burns my skin so bad. So that can just go straight away. That can go straight away. It's just not my color. That is just the worst thing out. It's not my color. This, not my color. Way dark, way too dark. I might just, I'm gonna see if Jessica can wear them. I love my baby creams. I'll keep those, both of those. I, like I don't even know what this is. It was a free sample thing, but I've worn it a couple of times. This is I don't think this is my color. I can't remember. I'll just check it out. And I love, I love this. This one I love. Oh, there, that was a quick declutter. Maybe I should keep going. No, because I have to put the camera down, sniff all these. Oh, here's my brush, my body brushing. I love doing that. Um, facial wax strips. Yeah, that didn't work. Okay, I'll sort that out later. But at least I got rid of some more stuff. But the actual makeup, makeup we'll do on another day. 
Here's another empty I just found. It's a Revlon um, concealer. I quite liked it. I don't like the color as much as the one I use now. This is a good backup, but I don't love it, but it's a good backup. Okay, so this is the makeup I wear every day at the moment. Yes. So I'm going to put these things into my makeup bag. The other things I will put away. Okay, and this is how we've ended up today. I'm really happy with it. I want to give the bathroom a bit more of a scrub down, to be honest. I just feel like it could the basins and that could just go have a bit more of a scrub. But anyway, I'm loving this. I just think this is great. My goal is to use these things up and then get a skincare range that I just really love that can just, rather than all the things, I would just rather have one thing that maybe I pay a bit more money for, but I really love. So that's the goal. I'm just so much happy, more, I'm just so much more happy with this now I can see everything. Okay, so this is everything that I've got rid of. I actually found when I was putting a few things away in my husband's drawer that all these eye drops for, from like 2016 up to 2020 have all expired. So this whole container there, this is all going, that's all going, and this is going to be gifted. So that's what we've achieved today in this lot. It's pretty extreme. And that's before even starting on the makeup. So this is how we're looking in the ensuite now. I'm pretty happy with everything. And I was just burning the candles because they just got really dusty. So I thought the easiest way to fix that would be to burn them. So they're gonna look better. And yeah, it makes me wanna have a bath tonight. Okay, I've even cleaned the mirror. The mirror needed a clean. Okay, so thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it the thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. I'd love to have you here. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video. See ya. Bye.